How's it going, Charles Botenston? We are moving along quickly, huh? Glad that you could join us on this video series, which is about marketing. Think about it. You have a purse made in China. You have another purse right next door made with just slightly better material, yet one is Gucci and the other one is sold at Walmart. One is marketed better. It's made for a certain type of buyer. It's the same thing with your home, is that if you don't market it correctly, people will treat it as such. If you don't actually make your home like this, this, this gem that it is, it's not gonna trade at, at diamond prices. You like that analogy? So marketing, number one is take professional photographs. It's not you, you have to bring in a photographer. Ours is only $100, he takes four amazing photos, wide angle lens, I don't know if you're into photography, but he takes about 15 shots and then they're layered on top of each other. He takes it really dark inside and really bright outside, and by the end, it's very bright inside and very dark outside. All the photos are put on top of each other, you can see what it's like outside and you can see how nice it is on the inside. There's, there's an actual art to photography. There's an angle of how you actually can shoot the apartment. You don't want to do straight on. You have to do a certain height, looking down, should I look it up? Should we include the wall? Should we include more of the floors? Should we include the window, the appliances? No, let's do that separately. Should we do it vertical, horizontal? There's an art to this. And if you don't have a floor plan, don't draw it out. This is the thing. People skimp on the marketing. You cannot skimp on the marketing. If you don't present it correctly, the public is not gonna wanna show up. If they don't show up, then they don't place offers. If they don't place offers, we don't sell the home. If you wanna do video, that's not 100%. That's something we do. That's how we get more money for our, uh, our exclusive. So photo, floor plan, you need an ama a great, great description. And I know a lot of people make fun of the real estate agents and, and how they make their descriptions. It's very corny, tons of adjectives, descriptive words, but that's what sells. You have the photos, you have the floor plan, you have the description, where do I put it? Number one is you have to put it on Street Easy. It's the only place that New York City actually looks at. Don't go to Trulia, don't go to Zillow, don't go to New York Times, don't go to Realtor.com, don't go to Craigslist, don't put it there, it's a waste of money. Nobody looks there. No. Nobody looks there. I don't care what anyone says. The majority come through a broker. And if they don't come for a broker, they come through Street Easy. That's it. But ironically enough, with the advent, and I love social media, is you have to put it on social media. For one is put it on Facebook, put it on Instagram. Anytime you have an open house, you put it there as well. And you use the descriptive words. Hey, listen, you know, obviously I'm not using a broker. Da -da -da, I don't want any brokers. Maybe I'll hire one in the future. But you know, price to sell. This is the last thing that a lot of people don't take advantage of and they feel embarrassed. Let the doorman know, say, hey, listen, I'm trying it on my own. I'm selling, not trying, I'm selling on my own. If you know anyone in the building that's looking to upgrade, if you're in a one bedroom and someone has a studio, here's a very, very unique way to actually sell this as well, which is go to your neighbor. Maybe your neighbors wanna blow through the wall and expand their apartment. Go to the one on the left, go to the one on the right, go to the one above or below, and then go two neighbors down. I've seen three combo apartments where the two people on the outside, this person owned and this person wanted to sell, they bought the middle one and this one, they made this huge apartment. They'll go around your entire floor and go to the people that have smaller units or bigger units and they wanna downgrade or they wanna buy for someone that, that they know or they wanna have their, their mom move in or their nanny move in, their assistant, whatever the case is, you have no idea. So go to your building, go to social media, go to Street Easy, don't go anywhere else. Use professional photographer, use a floor plan person. If you're really good on camera, then use a videographer. You know, it's one of those things, it's not necessary, but for us, we've seen higher prices when we use video. When you're doing the marketing, people are gonna tell you all these things. What I just told you is the only thing that works. You double it down, you use those resources. And this is the thing is, if people don't see results, they're like, all right, I'm gonna go to Trulia, or I'm gonna go to Zillow, or I'm gonna go to Realtor.com or Craigslist, or I'm gonna feature it, or I'm gonna sponsor it. It doesn't matter. Again, my name is Charles Botenston, founder of Botenston Properties International. If you have any questions, just reply the email that this video came in and I'll be happy to share uh, my knowledge and my advice and obviously consulting for free is uh, I don't get paid for it. So have an awesome day. Talk to you guys soon.